Boom, what up? So we're next only here back doing some more League of Legends actually on playing some buffed Hecarim on the new patch, patch 12.17. Uh, they buffed up his Q, now it scales, or sorry, well it scales harder, but uh, now it ramps up three times and reduces the damage and buffs it up. It's actually quite strong. And then they also buffed up your W. I'm just gonna show you it right here by taking it. And then also when this falls off, watch, it's only gonna lose one stack. I know I'm wasting time. But it loses one stack instead of the whole thing falling off instantly, which is really good because it lets you keep it up a lot longer. I thought it would mean you could probably play it in top lane, but it's really hard to pull off. You can probably do it. You just need to play against like a weak early game laner in top. Because if they're a strong early game laner, they're going to spam fight you and your Q like level 1, 2, 3, 4, whatever isn't very good. It needs some time to ramp up. Because once you get some points into it and the, the base damage goes up a lot, then the fact that you're reducing the cooldown with all your stacks and you're upping the damage with all the stacks matters a lot more because it's scaling off of a higher base number. So you need some points into this, you need some levels. And if you have a lane opponent that's going to fight you the whole time, it might be pretty difficult to get those levels. Okay. I'm going to have somebody so mad. Mike, you smited the blue buff, and somebody could have came over and stole it. You are right. I live life on the edge. I definitely want to go help mid, because he's getting bodied. I want to try and get this top crab first. But yeah, they buffed up your W, so you get armor and magic resist now from it, which is actually pretty insane. 35 of armor and magic resist at max rank. I wonder if I just like gank mid path to the other side of the crab. I, I regret using this. I could have smited for it, but Sma uh, hello. Oh, you know what that means though. Oh, oh. man, that's lame. It means this is up, but there's a chance this might be up too because we know he's gonna. Yep. Gonna do something in top lane. Could have cleared both of them and have like all of her red side up. Yeah, that's what happens. Okay. Could dive bot, but it's a little hard to pull off. Probably not the move. I, I really should just back here. There's too much to like do. I gotta run all the way back to here. I might as well just back by this, this, and run there. Boom, 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 boom. Dope. Moving! E to run fast. Well, let's go. Uh, should I max W second though? Nah, I'll probably still E, huh? Still get so many armor magic resist. I was thinking Q max plus W max in top lane, but again, like the first few levels, you're just still too weak. So in the jungle, it should work way better because then you can like freely stack this thing up your tier to get. I'm gonna go for Mura mana because I'm not a little baby. Mura mana plus the. Uh, the chem tank thing for the movement speed, the tank jungle item. Because I don't have damage. I have some tankiness scaling. That should be quite good. Uh, we double crab this guy, so we're in a pretty good position. Mid no flash, we force it out of him. Just jump forward. Have fun with that lane, brother. You gotta go back to base. buddy. This dude's level 6, man. He's a menace. I think I can get this camp before the crab comes up. I'm looking at this crab right here. Should be up in a second. Yeah, dude. 4.6% damage per stack, but it scales up based on how much uh, damage we have, too. That's a cool thing. Scaling both parts. Very fast clear. Whoa! Okay. And bot's gonna die. Damn! Uh, yeah, the wave's shoving to you though. So I can wait and get this. Top's gonna shove to us. They're all 
on bot side. Alright, cool. Make sure I right click there, buddy. Oh my god, this minion block is insane, dude. This game is wild. This game is wild, man. Oh my god, bro. This game. Woo! Actually, I gotta reset here. Option, the other option was clear this with him. That was probably what I was really supposed to do, but I need to back and get over here. Oh my god. Alright. Yeah, that's a rough lane, buddy. Oh. Oh god. Did you already use Q on the minion? Now you don't have it here. The Q at the end of that? Well, I guess yeah, because you killed the last hit with Q. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, I get it. Pop a potion. We have so much to farm right here. And all the healing you get back from this. Uh oh. I see them fighting. Ooh. Ooh. Shen ult, let's go. Does Shen have blue buff? Shen does. Gives me the info I need to know that this is gone. So I'm gonna move here. I mean, I don't actually think I do anything here. Just some damage. Oh god. Oh, I can't even help you out. You literally still have to go back to base. Holy moly. You were getting messed up there, pal. Probably get a gank off the top. Get a little bit of this loving. Nope. He's backing up. Huh? I mean, I'll take that all day. There's a chance this guy's right here. Yeah, for sure is. I'd be careful. Because you could also have this guy rotating. What's going on over here, pal? Literally, what? What the fuck is this guy up to? This is a free kill! Walk down, please! What the fuck is going on here? Bruh, how? I'm literally saving Smite Q auto to get it. It still gets yoinked. Fuck. I have no idea what that guy is doing. Sometimes I get really confused and I'm like, what is he doing? He must have somebody else here. This is a terrible play and he's dead 100% unless he has somebody else here. He'll only do this unless he has somebody else. And then they're, they're just stupid. Sometimes they're just stupid. It's hard because you have to know when to give like the benefit of the doubt. You miss out on possible plays because you're too afraid that they actually are like baiting it or something. But then when you make the right read and like the jungler pops out from the bush here when I pop the scrying orb or something, then it's like, duh, see? <laughs> it was just so odd. It's like, how can you defend this? Like, my mid could collapse on you, my bot, my top could collapse on you, I could come fight you. Like, how would you ever get out here? You already used Flash earlier. The Madman. You gotta be careful. This guy might rotate bottom. That's what I would be afraid of. I don't think I'm gonna get him. Yeah. Oh, goodness. Ow. Your potions? Nah. Struggle. Ooh, thank you.
please. That sucks. I need time to scale! Wish I got any of these fucking kills, man. Close! Put the W on. One more Q auto there, but the guy gets like a shield off of a, I don't even know, dude. His stupid ass passive. Just pain in the butt. We get dragged there though, so it's solid. Someone got the shotgun on too, right? Oh, only 150. Um, hmm. I mean, I'm just gonna stop him from doing this, that's all. Doesn't do crazy here. Not too bad. Bruh. Who did that? The Garen? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> This Vi did it like an hour ago. I really want to get my red and then go toward bot. Never mind. Just got a kill. I may keep going toward mid to try and help this guy. Because he's kind of boned. But. Uh. Oh, this guy gets out. Scaling up! I'm trying to get this quickly before uh, Vi walks into this bush. Yep. There we go. Q is now maxed. Feeling good. Oh, goodness. Yes! I got one. I'll be honest, I really want to go over here. Yoink the red away. Try and pull it into the bush. Auto Q, walk back. Auto Q, walk back. You can always do this with champs with short cooldowns in the jungle. Just be a little bit more efficient. Kite out the camp. Protect your HP as you're waiting. God, you are actually insanely fed, huh? Yeah. We did that shit so fast. Have my item. Dude, what the hell? I honestly don't even feel like I'm farming that hard. Jesus. Uh oh. I mean. <laughs> Alright. Probably not ideal, but. We'll take it, we'll take it. I'd be careful on this rotation. Uh-oh. Oh! Yep. There she blows! Ooh, the turnaround machine. I mean, I'm moving down. I want to run through this spot so I get the bonus movement speed. I'll go right here. Ooh. <laughs> He's gonna fucking take it again, dude. <laughs> Please. <laughs> oh, man. I think I want to rotate down and drop this thing bot side. Yeah, I can kill it. It's gonna be close enough. Sometimes if you don't place it close enough, it like hits the wave. It's really annoying. Cool. Oh. Oh. I mean, this is the play. Ooh, I tried to press R. Didn't get it off in time. This actually still might be a play. Oh! The fucking moves, dude! <laughs> Let's go. Oh, Jesus. What are we up to here? Oh. 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 Yeah, bitch. I don't think he'd kill me anyways. 
Hey, this might was kind of all I need. All right, I gotta get out of here before I die. What are you up to there, pal? Huh? What are you up to, buddy? All right, I'm feeling good. Moving. What's my damage up to? So it's 220, and then I can stack it three times for an additional 6.4% each time. Okay, bro. I mean, I can't do the math on that. We'll just say it's a lot, a large amount. Let me just scale it up on this. Ooh. pick right there. We gotta be careful because they're over here too. Scary. Yeah, I think we just do this. There's one. There's two. And then we also reduce the cooldown. If I forgot to mention, by 0.75 seconds. So 8.4. Jesus. Ooh. Once we get this. Oh, spicy. A lot of damage. Yeah, this is way easier to... Damn! This is way easier to pull off in the jungle than it is in top lane. Top lane, uh... Yeah. The fact that you have to fight from the beginning is kind of the whole issue. In jungle, you can scale up a little bit, like full clear. Yeah, you might run into somebody, but... 1v1 in the jungle, it's a little bit different than 1v1 in top lane. Where you're, like, trying to walk up and they can, like, force positions on you. Like, I'm trying to walk up for a farm. They can, like, start the fight as I go. Oh, boy. Um. Also, you can just mash Q. You can't cancel an auto attack with it, so. Um. I think there's a ward here. Ooh. Whoa! I'm trolling, dude. I'm so trolling. <laughs> I'm so trolling. <laughs> I just smited him and stopped, man. Nah, okay. Not ideal, not ideal. I'm pretty sure we're on a ward, though. Well, hello there, buddy. Should be free. Don't really have a wave, though. Huh. They are stuck. Oh, you dash forward? I don't know about that one. I'm gonna leave. I have my item finished here. I'm getting large. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it! Thank God he didn't do it. He heeded my warning. <laughs> All right, moving. Uh oh. Chen ult. Okay, Baron. Not happy about it. It's like get off my lawn. Ooh, ooh. Why well, hello there, pal. I hate all of you. Oh, man. Okay. 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 I see how it is. I see how it is. I mean, we got all their stuff out of them. Take it. We'll take it. It's gonna reset fast. I have home guards. I can get it back on the map extremely quickly. Ooh, I like. I like this. This item's interesting too, though. Why is this suggested so highly? I see it on the uh, U.GG as well. Attack damage, HP, AP, or uh, ability haste. I'm in. Can't really go too wrong with that. Solid stat allocation, just super cheap. I'm guessing is why. Oh my. God, dude. 
That passive though. Increased attack damage based on how much movement speed you have. Zooming! Oh. Surprise, motherfucker! Got him. Ooh. That hurt. Did not mean to get hit there. Do you have a wave? Oh no. No wave. Does not make Mike a happy boy. Waiting on this dragon. What are they gonna do? Two man it? Come on. I think we're okay here. I don't think we have to worry about Vi Garen two minuting the uh, Baron. <laughs> They're sneaking it! I'm just waiting on this dragon. There's not too much else to do. I guess I can just like run mid and push this way real fast too. It's not a terrible idea, not a terrible idea. Well, hello there, Garen. Rawr. I mean. Okay. Large chunks, baby. Large chunks. Oh! God damn, bro. I'm definitely coming to kill you, dude. Oh, pain. Okay. I like it, though. I like it. I just kind of want more speed. I have a need for speed. You can get that dragon, too. Grab this as well. Some speed, some chunkiness. You just follow it up with uh, Dead Man's Plate into... Well, I guess you can get a little bit more attack damage as well to scale this up even more. But, dude, it's doing 260. <laughs> what the fuck, man? If this ability hits, he gets a stack, which decreases his cooldown by 0.75. So you can get that stack three times. So you can take what? Come on, is that part of its stack too? Because I have a two point... Maybe it goes off of its base. I gotta go double check this now. Because my Q's only a 2.37 second cooldown. So what is it when I have three stacks up? Is it like basically up like nonstop? Hold up. There's one. There's two. I mean... By the way, when you auto attack, you don't cancel it. I just want to show more cues. Like, I can sit here and just, like, mash Q and I'm... Oh, it's going to auto attack. I don't know why I'm showing you my hand, but... It's just like ZE. You can't clip it. Sweet. That's wild. An ally has been executed. Okay. Got my item. That's cool, man. That's pretty damn strong. <laughs> that's pretty damn strong. Because that's like a point nothing second cooldown, and it's been amped up three times by 14%. Seems fair, seems fair. Jesus. This map with Hecarim is probably the best though. It's so OP. This guy's been feared the whole time. Look how fast I am, dude. I mean, I'm down to go back in. I just need a second.
Okay. Zoomen! Bro, what do you do against this? This is I'm a menace. I'm an absolute menace, dude. I'm gonna be real with you, in my head, I don't know why, but I was like, oh, I'll just E the tower, it'll die, and then I'll just ult and kill the guy. I E the tower, I did like three damage to it. The thing looked at me, I was like, huh? Okay. Uh, not ideal. <laughs> not ideal. Yo, this damage though. Ooh, I like it. I like it. Bro, Hecarim is a pretty strong late game. The scaling, pretty insane. This is what I said though. Like, early game, okay, maybe my Q is doing 60 damage and it's like, you know, four, five, six second cooldown. It's hard to get it ramped up. The mana cost actually matters. At this point, I have 2,000 mana, so the mana cost isn't even a thought. I mean, the thing is on a two second cooldown, I can reduce it by 0.75 three times, which means it has like a negative two second cooldown. So, helicopter. It should be even lower. I'm I'm wondering exactly how it works, but because 0.75 three times is 2.25, and it's a 2.17 second cooldown, so should basically have no cooldown, right? Hello, Garen. Whee! Where'd he go? There's no way he walked up. I said there was no way, but I knew very well that there was most likely a very large way. This whole team might be up here. Come here. Come here. Why would you stop moving? What? Okay. Probably because I misclicked. <laughs> That's why. Problem ghost. Pressing E. Holding! Hola! Your existence is over. Now your team shall join you. Moving. Oh, oh, oh. I don't want this. I don't want this. I don't want this. I don't really want this. your YouTube content as my main source of entertainment. Thank you, brother. No problem, my man. Hopefully you're entertained by death. <laughs> Bid. Ooh, won't be able to get enough. Oh, it's so annoying. You need some random tower to die, this one? No. No! Ooh, that's our fourth drag too. I'd be so damn fast. 7% out of movement, out of combat movement. That's honestly ridiculous. Gain 15% movement and then increase to 50% for six seconds after you're old. Hmm. And then we get attack damage based on how fast we are. I'm just going to grab blue reset. I need 100 gold. Drunk Irish guy. Thanks for the sub, dude. Garen, what are you doing? 12 months of the year. Welcome back, bud. Don't tell me just yoink this. Yeah, dude. I don't care, Karen. Screw you. <laughs> I'm after my objective. Sweet. Don't fight yet. Don't fight yet. Don't fight yet. Please don't. Skr skr. Moving. Oh, a nice little 135 attack damage. <laughs> Zooming, bro. Yeah, I'm not really sure why that guy is in bot lane, but it seems like we can punish that. By the way, that's why you see me press E and use my Q, but not actually right click the person a lot. Because you have all that extra movement speed when you use the, uh, oh, it's going to come down to me smiting it. Oh no, I have so much faith in myself. 
Aha! Oh, that's not good. I'm choking everything! Okay! Got them all chasing me. Boom! What up? Let's go, baby. Large place. Grande place. Please. Ah, oh, man. Oh, you want some, Garen? Do you want a little bit of this, Garen? Garen. All right. I look forward to killing you in Riot's MMO, okay, Garen? Just wait, buddy. Just wait. Unbelievable. Are you kidding me? 1300 damage, he's a monster. Talk about late game scaling. Oh, oh. Seems like a bad idea. Seems like a bad idea. Kinda want this. Zoom in. Moving. Trying to get over there ASAP. Ooh. Team is leaving. Uh, the fuck? Can you buff me? Got him. Nice. That's how we do. Garen, what are you doing? Get off my teammate! That's my quarterback! There we go. Let's go. You don't need a wave. I'm the wave. I think. Yo, how about you stop jumping over the walls and hit the thing, you idiot? <laughs> like, what? God, dude. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Let's go. Not too bad. Not too bad. What a game. Hecarim seems pretty good. Hecarim got buffed. Maokai, well, Hecarim Jungle, Maokai Jungle got buffed. I mean, I guess they're both technically top lane buffs too, but they're both still so hard to pull off in top lane. We can't really reliably fight. I bet Maokai is probably better, but he still is going to have uh, mana issues in the early game, that's for sure. But they added uh, max percent HP to his Q, but they took away a lot of his E power in lane. So you don't really get lane control. I like the buffs to his ult, though. He just, it just seems better in the jungle. It just seems better in the jungle. Just like this. Oh my god. That's a lot of damage, bro. That's a lot of damage. And we're like ridiculously tanky while we do it. Our W is giving us a ton of armor, magic resist, and uh, health back. Pretty damn good. Oh, yeah, yeah. I want to see self-mitigated. Yeah, dude. Tonky. 60,000 damage self-mitigated. The healing was 20,000. GG, well played. Hope you enjoyed that one. If you're watching on YouTube, like the video. Subscribe for more content like this. If you're watching on live stream, follow live stream. GG, well played. Thanks for watching. Peace.